A special thanks to our Kickstart coaches for bringing such great role models for the children of the programs. Inspiring the love of the game is a great responsibility. Well, it's a great program, you know, in, in partnership here with uh, Kia, we're literally affecting thousands of kids. We have about 150 coaches now across uh, the Toronto area that are giving kids a kickstart. So it's really a great program and we're a fabulous facility here. This is a lot of fun to come out and be able to spend some time with, uh, with the kids, see the smiles on their faces. I think MLSE and MLSE Foundation does an incredible job in terms of uh, getting around Toronto and, and giving back to areas that really need it. Having uh, the Toronto FC players here impacts everything. I mean, the children idolize these players, and good on them, they take the time to come out, uh, spend some time with the kids, and of course the kids are just awestruck. Hopefully, it, it makes it all a little more fun for them. They're most excited to play and to run around, and I think if there can be a few of us around who they can uh, look up to and, and kind of relate to a little bit, then I think it uh, makes the day that much more fun for them. I think it's very cool meeting all these players, like my heroes, like Jovinko and Bradley, and like everyone coming together to play a beautiful sport like soccer, and like it's just amazing and very fun and exciting. It's really cool to be facing other sites and seeing other people come together to play soccer. Do you play soccer yourself and what other sports do you play? I, yes, I play soccer, I play basketball. Basketball is my love of sport, but um, soccer is my second favorite sport. What kind of tips can you impart on them today? To enjoy it, to have fun, uh, and, and if it is something that they really enjoy, to practice as much as possible, to spend as much time with the ball as they can. There's no substitute for, for just spending time playing. Yeah.